Welcome Libras, I'm back y'all with another video. So this is going to be for the remainder of February. All right, so you have Libra's energy in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, north node or south node. You can utilize this video. All right, so let's get into it. Give me a message for my Libras, please. For the remainder of February. Give me a message for my Libras. All right, right here. All right, we got the sun, all right, and the emperor. Some of you guys could be dealing with the Aries. Okay, so. Let's see what messages we get. We got the six of swords, queen of swords, eight of wands. Nine of Pentacles, High Priestess, Justice, Ace of Cups, Page of Swords, King of Cups, and the Knight of Wands. Okay, so it looks like some of y'all are definitely like moving on. You're moving on to something new. You've cut somebody or a situation off. Some of y'all are even like traveling. And you like, if I got to ride on this on this ride by myself, then so be it. It is what it is. Some of y'all are going on a trip. I'm getting like a trip, an out-of-town trip. Some of y'all are traveling for fun. Some of y'all are traveling for work. But I'm getting for some of y'all, it's an actual move. And for some of y'all, you're traveling for fun. And for others, I feel like it's like you're moving on from a situation that no longer serves you. Some of y'all have decided that you're going to be single. And even if you aren't single, you're just focusing more on yourself. Okay, I feel like you got, you're looking for a new cup of love. Like you're looking for something new, new, new energy. Okay, so let's see what this, what this journey is, is going to take us. Let's see, why is the Six of Swords here? The lovers, like I said, some of y'all um, are dealing with a Gemini or a Taurus or a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, okay? But I'm getting that some of y'all have decided to move on. Why is the lovers here? The world, like I said, ooh, and the Ten of Swords, a situation is over. A situation has come to a close. Y'all may have been seeing a lot of nines. Um, a situation has definitely come to a close, okay? Yeah, and it was better for you anyway. It's like you're happier. Your your finances are looking good. Like you're feeling good. You're feeling more positive. Like you're, I feel like you're happy that this situation is over. Okay, you're kind of like happy that a situation ended. Now we got the Queen of Swords, okay? This is you guys' energy. Two of Pentacles, yeah. You had to make a decision. You had to make a decision, and you decided to move on from a situation. You cut this person off. For some of you, this could have been a Leo. A Leo could have got cut off. An Aquarius could have gotten cut off. But I'm getting like somebody got what they wanted, a wish fulfillment. <laughs> You got your wish fulfilled, me. Okay, it's like you want me gone, I'm gone. Oh, they wanted, they ready to go. Okay, but it's like uh, moving on. Queen of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Some of y'all have moved on. You're taking action. Some of y'all done went and got cute. Didn't I tell you? Y'all have walked away. Walked away. Why is the eight of wands here? Five of swords. Yeah, there was some drama. 
there was some type of drama. Somebody got betrayed. Somebody's feeling like something wasn't worth it. Y'all like, this shit ain't worth it. Uh-uh. Mm-mm. That shit not worth it. No, we good. You pay, may have given this person a chance to talk and tell their side of the story. Um, but somebody most definitely got cut off, okay? Yeah, somebody here was keeping secrets as well. Now, there could have been some type of battle or competition, possibly with the water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But I'm getting like somebody, somebody told somebody to keep, hey, we're going to keep this on the low. We're going to keep this a secret. But I feel like some type of secret got out and somebody decided to go ahead and make a final decision. Okay. Ten of Swords and the, Ace, and the Page of Pentacles. There's no communication. You haven't spoken to this person in a minute. And I feel like you're waiting to see how this person is going to respond now that you've walked away. The Nine of Pentacles is here. Nine of Pentacles. Why is Nine of Pentacles here? I saw the Ace of Pentacles. So y'all are feeling, ooh, y'all feeling like y'all good regardless. But look at this. We got the Seven of Swords. Seven of Swords and the Four of Wands, the Devil, ooh, the Star, and the Nine. Okay, so somebody here is, got taken advantage of. So this chapter needed to be closed. Somebody uh, is telling their side of the story, saying that they got played or taken advantage of. This could be you. Why is the Seven of Swords here? Page of Pentacles, yep. Somebody's calling out somebody, calling somebody out. Calling somebody out. Saying that they're childish, they're immature. Um, yeah, the truth is being put out. Somebody was giving somebody money as of being there, you know, being, you know, they felt like there was a bond. Maybe you felt like you had that type of bond relationship with this person. Maybe you could have been giving this person money, borrowing money, or they were borrowing money from you. But I'm just getting like the T is getting coming out. Somebody's calling somebody out. Why is the high priestess here in the past? The star. Okay, somebody here is special. Somebody here has a spiritual gift. Could be a Pisces or a Cancer here. I'm getting Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. I'm definitely getting Pisces with this High Priestess card. But somebody here has a special gift here. Somebody has a spiritual gift. They can see things. They can feel things. They're very wise. There's something special about this person. There's something special about this person. Why is the High Priestess and the Star here? Four of Pentacles. For some of you, something was supposed to be kept a secret, okay? Somebody made it worse by bringing the secret out. Why is the Four of Pentacles here? page of wands someone just couldn't help it they had to tell their friends they had to go tell this person that person we got the devil here it could be a capricorn And now somebody's tired of holding on. Somebody's tired of holding on and they're tired of having to always feel like they have to defend themselves. Okay, so maybe you've been feeling like you have to defend yourself a lot um, in this type of connection. You need to heal. There's a lot of back and forth going on here. You're trying to heal from this situation. This relationship was toxic. Okay, it was toxic. It was toxic. I felt like you kind of felt that. You were feeling, starting to feel that. Okay, your intuition was telling you that if you hold on to this person, it's, it's not going to turn out good. Now, we got justice for future energy, which is you guys' energy. The Ace of Swords. So the truth shall set you free. So 
somebody's saying that somebody was broke. I'm just seeing all types of things being said, being exposed. The Eight of Pentacles. Okay, I'm getting like somebody tried to tell somebody that somebody has some options or somebody trying to tell somebody that they need to make a final decision to end this. Okay. Ten of Wands. Somebody here putting a lot of effort. Somebody is saying that they put in a lot of work to get the shit in of the stick. Okay. Mm. I feel like y'all put a lot into something. Why is the Ace of Cups here? Queen of Wands. So some of y'all are putting on y'all little freakum dress. Put your freakum dress on. Putting on y'all sweatpants. You know, the one where y'all can see the print. With y'all, uh, you know, y'all getting ready to be summertime fine. Okay, because I definitely see y'all progressing, moving forward. You're looking at the situation with regrets, though. You're looking at the situation with regrets. Um, someone is saying, like, there... Someone is just saying, like, there wasn't a relationship... Or there really wasn't like that that bond that you thought that you had with this person. Someone here could even possibly uh, have a new girlfriend or, or a new boyfriend. Or this is your goal and your aim. We got the four of cups. I feel like you're disappointed. You're disappointed. You're disappointed. The emperor, okay. This could be Aries' energy as well, too. But um, the emperor energy is baby father energy or a father or older male could be in a picture. Somebody felt, you felt like this, you did the best that you could. Like the queen of pentacles and the six of wands is very much so a lot of financial success or this is being like in the limelight. Um, but having everything together, like, you're disappointed. You're disappointed. I feel like you thought that you could change this person um, because you had everything. Like, you feel like you had everything that this person could ever dream of, could ever want. But I feel like you found out that it wasn't worth it, okay? It wasn't worth it. Um, and, then, and then you just didn't see this coming. You didn't see it coming, okay? You didn't see it coming. But it came. Somebody put up a good fight. But somebody's also, I feel like you're, you're tired of that, actually. Okay, so this person here is spying on you. We got the Page of Swords. They're spying. The Ten of Swords. They're spying, but they're not saying anything. And they also feel like you missed your chance to be on their, on their train here. So they're looking at themselves as uh, a catch. You're looking at yourself as a catch, too. Why is the Ten of Swords here? Yep, Four of Swords. They're... They're not communicating. They're not communicating because uh, they don't want to. We got the Six of Pentacles and the Hierophant and the Two of Cups. This person wants a real connection. Like this person feels like. With the Hierophant and the Two of Cups, this is a higher level of commitment. They didn't get that higher level of commitment from you. So they're feeling like they didn't get what they wanted out of the deal. And I feel like you're feeling that way too. Like y'all both are feeling like y'all didn't get what y'all wanted out of the deal. Now we got the King of Cups here, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. The Nine of Cups. I 
feel like you want you want more of a loving, caring energy. You want more of a someone who uh, doesn't have a problem with showing their emotions or being open and can communicate. You know, the way that you want to. Yeah, see, you want emotional fulfillment. Kicking in Leo's energy, too. But then we got the Five of Wands and the King of Pentacles. Like, I'm getting this competition or there's just like a, a, a disappointment here. And somebody feeling like they won or they lost. It's like a battle. Okay, now the Knight of Wands is the outcome. Three of Pentacles, okay. So somebody here. Is always playing this their game. We got the Knight of Cups, okay. All right, so that's going to be the message that I got for my Libras. If this message resonated, hit the thumbs up.